Yo, what up guys? Mr. Gross here, back from MBR Starcast, about some more live League of Legends gameplay for you guys today. Today with a Jax gameplay, the first ever Jax gameplay on my channel, as Nemesis Jack. Only if only, I guess, well, he doesn't really, if he had like a big rocket launcher, he'd be like Nemesis out of Resident Evil, that would be pretty cool to be honest. But anyway, this is the first Jax play, gameplay I've actually ever done on my channel. I know you have, I've had a lot of requests from the comments that I do actually get to over read and um, people going, Jax, Jax, Jax. And obviously when I make my videos, I kind of sit there look at champ select and I generally forget what anyone's ever requested and I just go to a champion I feel like playing and I feel like a video what would be interesting in making and so forth and and so so and so on and Jax I've only played a handful of times there's I play, I've played pretty much every or I think I've played every champion on League of Legends but then you know I I have certain champions that I play a lot more than others and Jax is one of those champions which was similar to LeBlanc, LeBlanc I'd only played like or oh, when I made my video it was like the first time properly playing her like I probably played her in the past like two or years ago but I can't remember much about her and that video with LeBlanc didn't go or oh, it was alright I got pretty fair like 13 kills but I didn't really understand how to play her and now I've played maybe around 10 games with LeBlanc and I, I love her so much and Jax is one of those champions Champions that I've never really been that interested in. I've always seen other good Jax players, like, they've always been pretty nice. Um, so, we'll see what I can do today. I know when I've played Jax in the past, I've never done. I don't think I've necessarily failed hard on him, failed like hard on him, but I've never done anything special. So we'll see. I need to read read his passive. I think his passive is what makes him really strong. Is that you have to the thing? What I've never done with Jax in the past, if I if I think I'm right in what I'm saying, is that I've auto attacked them, ran away, and then they get the better trade off you with with Jax. I think you want to be continuous auto auto attacking because of your passive, and then I believe when you have your passive, with your ultimate when you hit level six, you gain additional attack speed or something, something around those lines, I have to double check, I could be wrong, I'm pretty sure I'm right, sub around somewhere what I'm saying. So anyway, we'll see what we can do with that old Jaxie boy today, um, never really made much use out of this skin, so it's good to actually have a game. He, I saw a video of Jax yesterday, I was watching some old fails or something, and I just saw a Jax get like a quadra kill on his own, I thought he was going to absolutely get butt raped, I was like, why did they put this video on it, it's like 4 and 1, easy, and then you just beat them all, I was like, what the fuck. Um, and I know Jax can be like a hyper flipping carry late game. I'm going to start off with Dorans. I'm unsure who I'm against today. I guess Malzahar mid. I don't really want to get against Malzahar, it'd be a bit annoying. And Yasu in the top lane. I'm not really faced against too many Yasus. Obviously, I've seen quite a few, and I always say when I. Uh, Yasu, or you have a bad Yasu, and there's no in between. Uh, you have one that fails hard, or one that actually does really well. So, obviously, we have a Shaco jungle. I'm not really a big fan of Shaco these days, to be honest. Um, I just, you might as well just play Eve instead, really. Or Varenga or Kha'Zix or something. I just don't really like Shaco anymore. Um, so, they have Jarvan jungle. Severe, I guess it's got to be Nidalee's and Severe bot, most likely. Against our Leona and oh, Severe, how about that? Um, so we'll see, we'll see. Let's have a look, quick little read. Let's have a look. Jack's basic attack increases his attack speed by 4% for 2.5 seconds. So that's where you want to be, to keep attacking them to try and get that additional damage. And with your W, causing its basic attack or leap strike to do an additional 40 damage. Yeah, see, I see. Uh, to Jax and there's a defensive stance for up to 2 seconds, dodging all incoming basic attacks and they're taking 25% less damage. That's pretty cool. After 2 seconds, Jax stuns the surrounding enemies for 1 second. Nice. And then obviously our ultimate, every third, here we go, every third consecutive strike Jax deals 100 additional magic damage. Should have went AP Jax. I've gone full AD Jax. I don't know if that's right or wrong. If you should go hybrid or not, I'm not sure. Um, and then our active grants him 34 armor and 25 magic resistance, which makes him a bit stronger. Sweet. Let's see if I can use my leap. Everything actually stacks off AP bar Z. So we are against Yasu. I think I'm going to take my W first. I hear you should take your E, but really we're not really going to do anything with my E, so... Obviously the fact he doesn't use mana might go in his favour. I could have went for a flask actually, maybe. Don't know, we'll see how we do mana consumption wise. The fact he doesn't use his mana is pretty good for him. Oh, I didn't know I was going to get that. So now he does have his whirlwind up. I just want to try and make him waste it. I just don't want to get caught on it. Obviously he doesn't really have his ultimate, so he's not really going to make anything happen with it, but... We'll see. I don't really want to fight him at the moment, purely as there's just so many fucking minions here. 
Oh, we get it. I can't believe I can actually got both those. Just only minions. Uh, not really worth it in bot lane unless our Sevilla kills their Sevilla. So he's pushing against me, which is good because the way Shaco's taking this jungle means that he can actually quite easily gank him now. If he chooses to. We'll see. Oh, that was the first minion, huh? That was never good. Yeah, so obviously he does have a little shield. That was actually nice damage just off 1W, so. We'll see. Let's see what he does. have so many minions going against me. Minions. Oh, I fucking turret. Oh my god, that sucks so hard. Make anything happen here? Oh, that damage. Um, really nice. I didn't think we. I thought he was going to least flash, and maybe we'd have to flash after him. But that damage. Uh, I, I think it was from me. I like to hope it was from me. That was really OP. That was the start I needed. I can't keep you, I believe I keep getting these minions. If I played any other champ, I think it's just Jack. So I guess my attack. I don't know, then I'm not really keeping my stacks up because I'm waiting so long to attack. I don't know if my W resets my auto attack. It might do. Anyway, that was a really nice start. That's what we wanted. Oh, that's a failed minion. Failure! Uh, I think I'll stay out for one more. Wave. I have a feeling it might reset. I'm not 100% sure. Just wanna push the wave into the turret, really. And not get counter ganked. That would suck fools. Let's get the big one. I wanted to do some damage to him, but at the moment I really don't feel like doing any damage. Things I gotta be really careful is I don't actually have my uh I've killed myself here now. If he ignites me. Did he ignite me at the end? I fucked that up. I'm a fucking retard. I don't know why I do it sometimes. That was really bad by me. I know I died. <laughs> oh, I'm so annoyed. After the start I shouldn't I shouldn't have never engaged on him. As soon as I engaged on him I didn't have my stun to get away. I don't know does he have ignite? I should know when he didn't use ignite, I guess he felt I don't know, surely using his ignite would be better than wasting his flash that killed me. It sounded like he used his ignite at the end, but I don't think he did. I could be wrong, I'm not too sure. But anyway, that was my flipping me being dumb and gave him a kill for no reason because I was greedy and typical. Ah, oh, nice. Typical um, thing that I would normally do. As I'm sure you guys know, I'm very greedy and that was just. Or there's no needed. I could have just killed the last minion and then backed, but. I decided to do be greedy. Um, but at least he has no flash now, obviously I don't, but I think that probably goes more into my favour. I, I think if he didn't catch me with that whirlwind, like the fact his whirlwind procced, it could have been different, but I don't know, we'll see. Uh, obviously, giving him that kill was not ideal. Why does every Leona I see get fed? I was in the game of a Leona and she was like 5 and 0, like for like 20 minutes. What's up with that shit? So we'll see. Um, it was just a very dumb death for me to just die to, and there was no need for it. But I think the thing that goes in my favour is obviously my passive, plus my alt passive once I hit level 6. So uh, Against me at the moment is there's so many minions that I just don't really want to fight him with minions. It's, it's the worst way to really fight someone. So he's actually going for his average play because I think it obviously attack speed or whatever works better with him or something like that. Around those lines, I believe. So now I have my alt, so this is where we really want to try to be trying to be fighting him now and we'll see what we can do. See we'll see it would be nice not to have given that kill because it was just really uncalled for but it's cool. Well, he has six as well now. So we'll see. Time is time is at the essence. Oh we have a Javon. He wouldn't went for it would have been stupid for him to go for me because I just fucking Bastard. I probably fucked my stun up then, really. I probably should have waited a little bit. It was a pretty easy escape for, uh... Oh my god. Oh my god! What the fuck? Pretty easy escape for Jarvan, really. Blew my, blew my stun a bit too quick now. But it's cool. Just 
kind of a bit wary of where Charvin might be. Oh my god. That big minion, I can't believe that just happened. Nothing worse than losing a big minion. Is he gonna... No. He's not gonna. We could have quite easily went in on him, I feel. Come fight me, you pussy owl. Fucking pussy. Probably one of it two balls deeper than them. Nice. I was waiting for him. Did he finally come over? I don't know why he didn't come over in the flipping first place. He decides to come over after like... Or oh, I'm glad he did come over, but obviously he could have come over a bit sooner. I'm hoping that his golem's here. Nice. Um, so yeah, good start. Really just a real shame about my death because... Um, there was just no need for it really. I did go a bit balls deep on him then. I just wanted to kind of... like I knew he was just going to run away from me. That was the problem, but... I don't think I'm going to actually take these, am I? Oh my god. It was worth to see if I got, if I killed the big one. <laughs> if I killed the big one, it would have been um I would have got the health back from it and the little one I would have killed easily, but unfortunately um I fail. The team is quite a D I dunno, I think the the boot ninja tabby boots would help me for trading against him, but then at the same time Mercury Treads would be for I'm getting ninja tabby for the lane and phase, see if that actually helps. I feel that um it would just help me a bit more in the laning phase against him. I'm just going to make my it even harder with my trading. But obviously it might come to back me to bite me with Nidalee and Malzahar. But I'll have to wait and see. Um, so <laughs> both my deaths are easily avoidable. I could have like got away from that. and There's no need to do. But I, if I had one more attack on it, I would have got the um, health regen and blah, blah, blah. So it's not the end of the world. No one, you know, I don't lose anything from it. Just lose a little bit of time. It gets me back to base quicker, I guess. Um... So it's alright. No problem. Um, too many minions here really to actually choose to fight him. You see there the damage that they're doing. I don't know what the cooldown of Zolt is because that seemed quite sort of wasteful to me. At least I have the slow from my cutlass now and hopefully that's going to come to hurt him. Fucking minions. OP. We'll have to wait and see. I'm feeling happy, which is always good. Let's see, he has his flash up now, so do I. I don't have a mic knight, but he does, so. i have to wait and see. It's kind of like the only thing I worry a little about is my mana consumption, because we'll see. He gets, uh. Well, he doesn't have mana, so. He's got nothing really to worry about. That's why I think the flask wouldn't have been a bad start, but bad uh, start an item even. That's cool. Damage. Nice. That was even without ignite. I did actually use my cutlass though, which is always a, a bonus. I normally always forget to use my active, so. Uh, gotta be a little bit careful here. I haven't actually been plopped, plopped a ward down this game. So let's say this was the problem. Ha, ah, motherfucker. I was trying to avoid using my flash at all costs then. And we got away with it. What I do have to turn on is because I reset my league. I actually finally turned it on, was my uh, smart cast, and then because I reset my league, I unfortunately. Um, it reset everything. So I believe it's uh pretty sure it's this bad boy. Am I right? I'm pretty sure I'm right. Uh, w E R D F which put that as four. Surprise, I spell. Uh spell is not ready. Why does it say that? Why does it say all my spells are not ready? I think I've done something wrong here. Uh, what do I want to go for? I might actually just get a Sheen here, just because I can afford one in a second. I just think that's just going to make everything a little bit more OP. 
I think I've done something wrong because I can't even activate my any moves. What have I done? Or my games? Oh no, I thought my game was lagging really hard then. All right, let's restore those to defaults. So I've gone because they're items, are they? Self cast. Maybe it's. Oh, I'm an item fucking retard. That's why I'm in days. Oh, I'm an idiot. We haven't got time to sort it out at the moment now. But they're yeah, a fucking idiot. <laughs> troll myself. Wow. I was lucky I realised that. Fucking troll. Oh, 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 so we are actually three or three to one because obviously I died to golems and I could have easily avoided my first death. It's just again me being silly, but there we go. Oh, I can't. Oh my god. Lol. What the fuck have I done? Restore. Okay. I think it's restored. I don't think it restored before because I couldn't actually do my. There we go. I couldn't actually do my E then. <laughs> but he flashed anyway, which was kind of good, I guess. But. Yeah, I couldn't do my E. That's not really. Yeah, it's actually. Well. It's actually working now. That damage though. Oh, I don't know why I don't play Jax more. What? He's so easy to kill now with Mike Knight. He has no flash either. Oh, that damage. Why have I never played Jax before? I do not know. So easy to kill at the moment. So easy to kill. Oh, I'm lagging. I'm lagging. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please say I killed him. Oh my god. What the fuck? Fucking mouse heart every fucking time. Why oh, can't? Oh my god, I was meant to queue onto that. I pressed W instead. I do not know what happened there. All it is I know is I lag super hard and I well, I wouldn't have died to mouse heart because if I know what's happened, I'd just run back that way. So I'd have never been in the position to have been killed by mouse heart. Just unfortunately, I just lagged super hard then. And you always hear people saying lag killed me, but I hope you guys could actually see what I saw then. Or there should be, unless the fraps is just flipping trolling me and you actually just see it as it is, but that was bullshit. Luckily, I, if I didn't kill him, I'd have been so annoyed because he hasn't got any kills. I know he did, of course, I died to him at the start, like a little newbie me. So, um, yeah, it was a really weird. Well, all three deaths should have been avoided this game, but there you go. Such is life. But the main thing is we've got four kills. CS is okay, it's not like amazing, but it's alright. I don't know why I'm lagging though. Dropping down some frames there, which is not good. I don't know what's causing it. Why you do this to me, League of Legends? So I really want to play ranked, but my game has been bugging out over the last few days. I just don't want to go into ranked, and it happened to me in my Zach game. I played ranked, and the whole I just couldn't do anything all game. It was fucking bullshit. We lost, and Warwick flipping killed me like four times every time I was just AFK because my game froze. Like bullshit. The fact that the thing was scary for him with his sheen, which I'm really kind of glad I picked it up, is the fact that I can turret dive him. And that was about my knight I killed him as well, so I'd be really worried if I was him. So far behind in CS. So yeah, I, I'm really happy with how things are looking at the moment. Hey, knights. What? Oh my god. Why the fuck is Malzahar in my lane every 10 fucking seconds? Oh my god. I let well there was nothing I could do. I did lag for a second, but... Well, I, to be honest, I haven't warded, which is my own fault, but... I just don't expect this fucking room. <laughs> this Malzahar is fucking... Being a... Biatch. At least they get dragon. Which they should do. Because they just killed the jungler, so... I think Shake is too interested in killing the... AP shakers, uh, about that. Uh, he shouldn't get my turret. Oh, fucking. So yeah, my own fault for not really warding. My trinket was down. And I haven't bought any wards, which is you know one thing. I've kind of got a bit bad really with warding this season. Um, but anyway, it's not the end of the world. But Malzar's just really. Oh, he's gonna get my turret. I think if he carries on attacking it. Malzar's just been a little bitch this game to me. Which GG to him. He, I guess he's a lot more quicker than what Heimendinger is as a champ. And the fact that he killed our mid lane turret, and I I keep lag or the uh, lag, I did lag then, but there was nothing I could do about Malzahar coming into my lane. Unfortunately, it was just GG. Oh, that's cool. Oh, 
Fuck him up. Proper war down. Mazahar was. Oh, you bastard. Mazahar was heading over and this, yeah. Of course he is. Um, there's nothing I could do. I knew he was fucking coming as well. I knew he was coming. I really should probably stop playing so aggressive. The thing was, I knew he was coming because I saw him leave our jungle and cut war well, was running away from them, but it was pretty obvious that he was coming up in my direction. Um, the thing was, uh, I knew I could kill uh, Yasu before he really got to me and was able to ult me, but the thing was, I, sh I was hoping to kill him with my Q, but which I didn't, and then because I wasted my Q, I had to flash just to kill the kill. So we have 5-5, five five, which is a bit annoying. Um, Mazahar, <laughs> I think he's got all three kills off me, hasn't he? he well, he killed me when I lagged up here and he was there, and then he killed me just then, and then he killed me before that, so yeah. He has got fed off me, no doubt about that. I just don't understand how he's out farming fucking Hyman doing my 40 CS, and he has the turret, yeah, he's in my lane so often. Um, there you go. At least I've got Blade Marine King now. The thing is, the scary thing is for them, is that Mazar's getting his kills, is that Yasu's so far behind me, it's really should be a worry for them. So I'm really quite fed over him. Even though Mal uh, Malzahar keeps coming to my lane, you know, I'm still out farming him. I'm almost out farming Maldahar as well. So even though I've died five times, which is really kind of good to be honest. I just need to get this turret and then I can stop really... I can just forget about... Um, they're all ribbon and shake, uh, shake okay. uh, Then I can just really forget about this top lane because I'm just fucking fed up with Malzahar ganking me. <laughs> I can gank me more times than what Jarvan has. I can't remember Jarvan actually ganking me to be honest. But with my Blade Ring King plus the passive and everything, we should just really rake this turret down. Which is nice about Jax, he's quite a mean killing turret machine. But they're all missing in the mid, or Yasu and Malzar, of course. Why should I be fucking surprised? Oh my fucking god. You're faggots. You old faggots, that's what you are. Um, I knew it was coming, I fucking knew it as well. I knew it every time, but I still died from it, even though I know it's coming. Um, not really much we could do then. I got the turret, which was the main thing, but obviously the fact that, you know, he came up, there was nothing I could really do about that at all. Yeah, Sue picks up the kill this time, but really I'm not worth as much gold as when I was in the first, because I'm not on a killing spree, I'm just not picking up kills like I was when I was originally on my killing spree. Um, and then there's not really much I can do about that, to be honest. They do. It was obvious it was coming because they both left mid lane and Jarvan then went to mid lane to farm. But the thing was, like, I really wanted to secure that turret because, you know, I, I was, I'm just going to keep getting repeated gank like this. But it's cool, you know, it doesn't. Maybe I should have went for Mal. Wow, that AP damn it. Wow. Please don't die to Yasu, though. Oh. Uh, that AP damage was pretty strong then. Yes, he's now starting to get fed. That's <laughs> where the comeback starts. Um, so yeah, it was just, I don't know, I've just been quite camped hard by Miles hardest this game, which is fair play to him, because I haven't warded, that's probably one downfall, but then for an instance in that last death, there was, I knew they were coming, but I was just more interested in getting the turret than anything. Um, so I pushed this wave up a little bit, and then just fucking back. And to start doing something like this game could have went, or well, I could have snowballed. It might as well had to do what he had, to, uh, what he's done to me. Otherwise, I'd just snowball a lot quicker and farm, and also um, in kills against Yasu. But it's cool. Um, what's happening in the bot lane? Are they all gonna get fucked up. Where is our severe? Three to one to the two to two. Not too bad, yeah. I just want to get a bit more tankier now. If you try to be a bit more resilient. Uh, I don't know what to say. Malahar has just been an absolute beach to me this game. I know that much. Last time I has not really. Well, he's not really a Raymer at all, is he? I am going to have to get some magic resist this game. It was kind of what I was worried about when I didn't take my Mercury Treads, but the YOLO. I don't know if the Hydra would actually be any good on Jax. It would probably help me clear. I think I'm going to get my Triforce next, though. 
Fuck you, Heimdinger. You fuck yourself. I'm taking all that farm because you just got me that. Let me get raped this game by Malzahar. You don't deserve any farm. Oh, Yasu. Yasu, where are you going? Fuck it, I'm gonna hide around the mid lane. Shaq is taking all that farm now. What to do? What is bottom doing? They seem to be going pretty balls deep. Literally. That was pretty retarded. Push this, fuck it. That uh, Jarvan looks pretty tanky. Malzahar, everywhere I want to be is always Malzahar. Ah, oh, you're so fuck now. Finally. Revenge. Sweet fucking revenge. I'll tell you that much shit. Oh, I thought that was going to be the double kill then. Not today. But still, at least we killed him. That's 66, we just need 5 more assists and we'll be laughing. Oh, I was so close to getting severe then, I was just out oh my god, this high many. <laughs> uh, I was so, I was just out of range unfortunately then. That would have been I'd have easier killed her if it wasn't for that. The fucking turret, oh my god, the turret. I thought I was going to get the turret, but unfortunately he uh, procked his flipping thingy procked so it knocked me up in the air, and because it knocked me up in the air I then took turret aggro because all the minions died, and just bad timing again. These deaths this game, do you me? So easily avoided, so many sleazy deaths, but fuck it, for the lols. Got Heimdinger killed as well because it really, I should have just backed off, but I felt confident to get in the turret. Yeah, for it. she could have waited a little bit actually. Saying that. Never mind. What are they gonna do? They have to kill Jarvin because Jarvin's just gonna smite that shit out. Shaco, is he gonna go to Dragon? He can get there. He can definitely get there in time. Leona's delaying her really well. It's the case if he can make the steal. What's he gonna do? How's he gonna play it? Get the fucking. Get the motherfucker. Oh, you got it. Fair play. Nice. I'm even killed Jarvan. Really nice. That was nice. Good job. I didn't think he was actually going to do it, but he proved me wrong. I like being proved wrong. Free dragon. That was really nice. Really nice. That's what we need though. I couldn't get there. <laughs> took me so long to fucking get there though. was the problem, but it was a good job by Leona, really kind of delayed that quite well. I'm get the turret. Happy days, happy, happy days. Oh, you bastard. I was coming for you then, bitch. Kill us fucking pet. 12 gold, OP. Um. So yeah, I was just hoping he wasn't really watching, but unfortunately he was watching, so it wasn't really much he could do about that. I can almost afford, I can afford my Triforce. Nice. That should really hopefully make me OP. I'm really loving Jax. You know, a lot of my deaths could have been avoided this game, to be honest, but I've had good fun though. That's the main thing. Really quite strong. Ah, oh, the Shack, eh? Nice. Oh, I, can't, I, can't, I can't fucking see him. I just stunned him and fucked him up, but I lost uh, vision on him because uh, obviously he went into the bush. The thing what I was waiting for was waiting for him to do his QE combo because as soon as he does that he couldn't escape. So that was the thing what's really nice. And because they're all bought and Jarvan's dead, it's an easy top lane turret here. Really loving Jax, I just don't know why I've never played him in the past. I do not know. Oh my fucking turret, I don't give a shit. I should do because that's miles hard coming. I don't want to be really low for him. Fuck it. At least just teleports down, I guess. We probably could, I don't know. I don't know. That's not yet in the world. I could get the mid farm. Are they gonna do it? The double kill. Yeah, boy, do you. 
His AP check is actually doing quite alright. I think the fact that he's gone for that attack speed item with a stinger. Is, oh, Nash is too. Is it from the stinger? I don't know what I'm saying. Nash is too. I have a feeling someone to do with a stinger. I could be wrong on that. But the Nash is too because the attack speed and the ability power works out quite well. I believe it gives him like his attack. What does it do? It's someone to do with the basic uh, attack deal 15 plus 31. So that's what really makes it quite nice. And obviously everything stacks off AP as well. Hello. Probably didn't need to use my ignite, but I don't know what she was doing then to be honest. Oh my god, fucking Mazar. I don't know why I'm ever surprised about this fucking dude. Nothing I could do there. I was just hoping Shaco might have got over in time, but I didn't have my stun up or anything. Or anything at all, really. No flash, no ignite, because I burnt on Nidalee. There wasn't really much I could do there, really. Um, just Mazar there every fucking time. Don't know how he does it. I don't know how he does it, but it's cool. <laughs> I really love and chat. I can't believe I've got eight deaths though. I think a lot of them have been quite easily avoided, but there you go. The attack and he took the wrong one. That was pretty I thought it was pretty obvious which the right he had the right one, it was really weird that he went and then went back for the other one. And then suicides. Oh is he he's dead, isn't he? He's dead. He's doing alright though. AP. Interesting. What can I afford then? I guess I just gave Warmogs, make me nice and tanky. Uh, I'm just getting home guard boots as well. I've got nothing else to spend my money on, at least it's going to get me. I've died so many times, so I'm probably going to die a load more, so at least it's get me around quicker. I have 220 now for every additional third strike, that's OP. OP. Can I queue into this? Leona, come to me. Fuck it. Motherfuckers. I have to do it the hard way. Eh, uh, buddy. I even get the Baron, that's how OP I am. I just don't understand why well, I've never played Jax before. This guy is so OP. So fun as well. He's my kind of champion, I just don't know. I don't know, I have played him in the past and I should never really got on with him, but maybe something's actually twigged or... It's been a quite a good game. Yasuo's a bit of a squishy target as well, to be honest. And obviously, Sheku got us that nice kill. And we did give him away that kill, and then Malzahar camped on lane, but it wasn't enough to stop the almighty Jax. And now I'm just, like, crazy. Just, I'm just from Triforce Blade Rune King. Obviously, then with my passive, and then a the passive from the ult, it's just OP. 3000 HP as well. It's quite a lot to try and uh, chomp through. I haven't really needed the mana, to be honest. I've just been able to kill them so easily without it. I'll be kind of careful here. I kind of want the turret, but at the same time, I don't know where anyone is, and no, my luck, they're all coming for me. I've died so many times already this game. Let's see if I can try and not die anymore. That's going to be a bit easier said than done, but. Oh, you bastard. You're a bastard. You're a fucking bastard. That's what you are. That's what you are. Um, I was just hoping he was coming this way instead of this way, and I was going to try and leap onto a ward, but I don't know. Yeah, we destroyed Nidalee and almost destroyed Yasu, but Malzahar, always there. So much for not dying. <laughs> Got a bit carried away then, I think. Um, oh well. So, what to get? What to get? Yes, a, uh, I don't know. Situational, I do the magic resist would be quite good. You know, the last whistle would be pretty OP, I think. But then I guess the magic resist is probably better. If I get a spirit resarge, at least it's gonna um, stop Mao's eyes. Anyone who's flipping kill me, I think this game. I think Yasu's killed me twice actually, didn't he? I think the rest has just been flipping Mao's oh, and Maybe not, because I've done nine times, he's only got six. Uh, Mao's has probably killed me for all his six kills, I reckon. It probably would just be me. Who fed Malzahar? But still, I've got one third of our team's kills, so I'm really, really fed. Severe's fed as well, so that's good. That's all good. Got some magic resist now, so hopefully, or it probably won't help us that much, but we'll see. Or I could turn it into a Banshee's Veil, I guess, but I think the uh, Switch is actually probably better with the passive on it for my lifesteal and the cooldown and all that good shit. So who's here? Is this going to be like a Nidhi trying to spear it through or something? He tried. No, he did try. Gotta give them effort. An A for effort. An F for failure. 
I feel like maybe I need some armor, I don't know. Still need something on me. I feel. Ooh. Nice spears. <laughs> you fucking troll, yes, dude. Why would he do that? You fucking know we're there. I kind of want to ult, but I know that I'm going to need it for. Miles are. Nice. Tank up the turret like a boss. Attack speed. Oh, wow. God almighty. Tracks is OP. I will definitely play on this bad man again. Why oh, it took me so long to do what playing League of Legends for almost three years to realise how OP this Jax was. Um, so yeah, a lot of silly deaths this game. A lot of either the avoided deaths, just me being greedy most of the time and not warding, but it didn't stop us. We still got uberly fed and had a nice farm and just raped Yasu and raped the whole team. So yeah, really good fun game. First time uploading the Jax video. And hopefully you guys enjoyed it. You probably flame me for all my newbie deaths, but sometimes you gotta be a noob. So there we go. Nevertheless, hope you guys enjoyed. Take it easy, have a good day. Peace.